Hey guys, what is up? Welcome to the video, ladies and gentlemen. Today we look at high medium work rates. Right footed, four star, four star combination. Clarence Seedorf. Now, this car looks very underwhelming compared to his car last year. His car last year, his Prime Michael Moments car, was ridiculously good. I remember when he came out, he was going for 3 million coins. Of course, this card is nowhere near as good as that card. But this card still looks very good. It's still very, it's a very impressive car. Long shot, take a trait. I don't like his agility, but I tell you what, in game, I used him in cam. Now, I found him to be a very, very good cam. And the reason why I loved his shooting, but most importantly, I loved his passing. Now, that was a fabulous pass there to Diego Maradona. I just felt like in central mid, he was wasted. Because of his high medium work rates, this guy likes bombing forward. And you gotta cater for that. Okay, so Clarence said if you like going forward, that's fine. All right, play cam. Put a hunter on him and I tell you what, he was fantastic. Honestly, I loved him in cam. I felt like with the hunter, his pace was fine. It wasn't an issue. I mean, don't get me wrong, he's not mega quick, but he certainly is quick. His free kicks are fantastic. His power shots, brilliant. Love taking long shots with him. I thought, if you look at this game on a fun perspective, I felt like I definitely had fun with him. I loved his dribbling, honestly. On the ball, he felt so good. His ball control, his dribbling was fantastic. One of the issues I did have with him, though, was his agility. He does turn a bit like a truck, but one thing I love about this card is the enjoyment factor because when this guy shoots, he's got TNT, rocket, and cannon in his boot. Take a look at his long shots. Look at his positioning. I love it. Make a pass. He bombs into the box, and then that. So you've got that ruthless cam where you feel like, okay, he doesn't have the most pace, but you can take a long shot from anywhere and most likely he's going in. He scored some ridiculous goals for me, honestly. This card is brilliant. I mean, look at this, the way he just gets into the box and I found him to be extremely clinical. For someone who has 85 finishing, with that Hunter, I felt like his finishing was 95. I mean, look at his finish right now. Look, a little bit of a dribble. And from here, he gets that at the back of the net. Oh, what a whip that was. Absolutely sensational. Honestly, my opponent had, had enough. But here again, here's Clarence Seedorf on the ball. Look at that. Oh, he's fantastic on the ball. Look at his dribbling. Honestly, I really rate his dribbling. And from here, check this out. From here. Oh, that is just borderline ridiculous from him. So he's got that in his locker where he can just take a shot from anywhere and most likely it's going at the back of the net, whether that's a finesse, power shot, whatever. This guy was an absolute beast. He is an absolute tank and something. If you're not into having fun and you're into someone who can take long shots, don't look away because I tell you, he's got good dribbling. He's got a very, very good power shot. And I feel like this guy's your man if you want to have fun in this game. Defensively, he can definitely tackle. But like I said, it's not something that I wanted from Sadov. I didn't want Sadov to tackle because I had him in camp. If I want someone who can tackle, I just get 60k Conte. And Conte is unbelievable. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. I'm going to give him a 9 out of 10. Thank you very much for watching. Please like and subscribe. And peace out. I just wish his pace was a bit more and his agility. That's what lets the card down. But unbelievable card.